Hey guys, welcome back to my channel, El Nino Brujo here today. I'm going to be doing a reading on Jimin. He's another BTS member. Um, you guys requested that I do this video. And I'm going to be using these decks. I'm also going to be using the Adromita Love Oracle deck. So let me just say a quick, quick prayer, okay? And let's get started. So let me connect to his energy. In the name of the Father, Son, and the Holy Spirit. Call upon the Archangels to connect me to Jimin's energy. I'm hearing deep breaths, deep breaths. Jimin, take a deep breath. Just relax. Okay. I feel like the wind will be very calming for you. Like the with us, I'm hearing like chime sounds, like the wind would be very very calming for you okay because you're look at that you are you're stressed right now you're worried you think a lot i was just picking this up with the other one i was just picking that up with the other one like them feeling really stressed out them kind of feeling like um they them kind of feeling like they um really like stressed out like that type of energy. You know what I mean? Like it's that type of energy here. It's so crazy. All right, let me pull. Let's see what I get. Let me turn so you guys can see these cards. Lord Jesus, let me move these. I'm sorry, y'all. I keep saying that, but I'm sorry. I am so, 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 so sorry. All right, so let's see what energies come out for him. Okay. Yeah. Okay. The overall energy we have is the Three of Swords. So, wow. This is literally a repeat of what I just said in my other video. Watch my um, Jungkook's video where it's kind of the same. They mirror each other so much, y'all. Like, I wouldn't be surprised. Like, did they ever live together at one point? Like, live together, like, together? Because their energy meshes so well together. It's almost like they're kind of in the same energy length. There's a lot of swords here. Eight of swords. He feels a bit stuck right now. He feels a bit trapped. He tends to he tends to overthink a lot. He tends to he tends to be very stuck. Okay. I also do get an energy that he tends, if he takes a shower, he tends to like sit there and really think. Shower, maybe he takes a shower, it could be very therapeutic for him. When he's standing there, the water's running, he tends to kind of um, really, he also really overthinks a lot too. Like he tends to be in his head a lot. The Ace of Pentacles, it's that same energy. He feels freaking stuck. He feels trapped where he's at. There's another opportunity that he wants to go towards that he sees as a success. I also feel like, and it's the same energy, like he wants, to, I, I wouldn't be surprised if he wants to do a solo as well, or he wants to make, do something new here that could be a very successful. It could be collaborations. It could be something new. Also something about a clothing line. I don't know if he has a clothing line, but I do see something about clothing. I also do see him changing his style and maybe going through a fashion change, maybe changing his hair or changing up his wardrobe. The three of swords here tells me that there's a lot of heartbreak when it comes to, when it comes to their energy, it's almost like they have a lot of issues when it comes to love, when it comes to like romance and connections. Like I don't even know these guys, but it's like, I know them at the same time. Three of swords, it's like a lot of heartache when it comes to it's like, yeah, I have all the money. I have the success, but I still feel sad. This could also be like mild depression. I do see that a lot of the BTS members and as well as like a lot of K-pop um, members, even like US guys, you know, guys that like are, you know, in the industry have a lot of depression. Um, I'm here also hearing dark side because the angels are showing me the dark. 
the dark, the black right here. So I'm hearing bleeding heart. So he does, he has like a dark side to him, especially when it comes to love. He's had a lot of heartache. He's had a lot of pain. Okay, he's had a lot of sorrows when it comes to love. Um, I do see that he does want to move in a new direction, but it's like that same energy of him kind of feeling a bit trapped here. The Nine of Wands. Yeah, he feels like a wound. He The Nine of Wands, he's been through a lot when it comes to love. Also, did he ever like injure his hands or his or his ankles or his feet? Because they, they keep showing me like an injury. I don't know if he ever had an injury, if he was ever hospitalized. This is also someone who's like helps a lot of other people. He, like, he tends to, he's, the thing about him is I do get the energy that he tends to kind of be very nurturing. He has a feminine energy about him. And maybe he, he likes to take care of people. Or he feels like he needs to save people. Maybe this, maybe a woman here, maybe a significance. Um, he tends to be, he tends to be like that type of guy, but he always ends up getting heartbroken here with the freaking two of cups. I can't make this up. This is a different deck, but look at that. This is from my other tarot deck, the two of cups, something about it. He's been wounded when it comes to his relationships, when it comes to his partnerships, maybe he tends to attract wounded people or he tends to, um, try to take care of connections that maybe it's like carrying other people's problems that are not his problems here. Okay, the three of wands, he's definitely waiting. He's waiting for something to come in or waiting for someone. He's waiting to hear some news. This is also traveling. Okay, so with the ace of cups reversed, king of pentacles, moon card, the two of swords, and we have the king of cups. Now, when I saw these cards, I'm like, okay, let me see how I see this differently. The Ace of Cups reverse is like literally, you know, pouring out your heart, unrequited situations. This could also be um, overgiving, you know, over like not not getting very fulfilled when it comes. There's a lot of cup energy. He is very he is a very sensitive guy. He's very emotional as well. He tends to give his heart away. He tends to wear his heart on his sleeve a lot as well. And he does suffer a lot because of this. Now, I don't know if there has ever been any like questions of the sexuality or people have maybe fans have accused him or people around him. But I, with the two kings and this ace of cups in the reverse with the moon card, the king of cups, this could be like someone could be suppressing their emotions, their feelings here for someone. Um, This could definitely be like, it feels like, I'm not, again, alleged purposes only, guys. Don't take what I'm saying serious. It could be maybe some, like, inner struggles, maybe confusion, maybe confusion with sexuality here. Maybe there's a bi-curious energy. If this is not him, this could be, like, someone may have a thing for him, and this is person's keep suppressing their feelings, or this person wants to keep it hidden. This could be someone also in the industry. There could be two kinks here. I'm also hearing fluid. Maybe this person could also, this person definitely is very fashionable as well. This person is very flashy, I'm hearing. this. If this is not his energy towards someone, I do feel there's a male energy that may have a crush on him, may be kind of obsessed with him because I was hearing that earlier, obsession. Someone could definitely be obsessed with him, okay? The Ace of Swords, yes. Yes, I, this is the truth. So this is clarifying what I just said. There's definitely some information. Like he's definitely going to get some news on something or he's going to be enlightened about something here. He is also going through a spiritual development. Okay. There is someone that's going to give him. He can also be getting advice from someone here or this could be someone giving him advice. There's definitely some truth that he's trying to kind of look at in the freaking two of pentacles. The nine of swords, the devil. Oh my God. There is someone... This could even be a female here. There's someone that either has a hold over him. He has a hold over this person. Someone could be like obsessed or in their head about a decision, feeling trapped, feeling stuck here. Could be Capricorn energy. We have Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, Capricorn again, Earth energy, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Either he's stuck on someone, someone's stuck on him, or this is like even like some having information over someone and this is stressing someone out here. Allegedly, 
I definitely feel like there's a decision that he needs. He needs to gain more balance in his life. He needs to balance out his chakras as well. But there's something here that I'm hearing confusion. Allegedly, okay. Don't don't take that what I just said this part serious. I could be wrong, but I do feel like there's people that have been quest questioned his sexuality. But there's something that he's worried about, something that he's stressed about, he has anxiety about. He also may need to get a new mattress or get a new bed. He also may be changing his sheets as well. He may be decorating something here. Um, let me pull that. All right, now let me see what this deck has to say. So let me... Whew. These cards are hard to shuffle, y'all. Let me adjust this right here. Okay. All right. So, we have Inpat. Yeah, so he's very, he he tends to be very, like, very empathic. He has, a, he has a light about him. I definitely feel like he feels like he has to take care of other people. Or he, there's a sense of him being very, he's very, he's a very sensitive guy here. Okay, he's a very, 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 very sensitive guy. Okay, we have online stalking. So someone could definitely be stalking him, okay? Let me put these cards over here. Someone could definitely be stalking him as well as what I'm hearing, okay? Someone could definitely be stalking him. Someone... Sorry, guys. <laughs> My bad. Someone could definitely be stalking him, okay? We have acne. So he does he have acne? Does he ever break out? He may break. He needs to take uh, better care of his skin. So he needs to use better skin products. Okay. He needs to take better better skin care. He needs to take better care of his skin. Is what I'm hearing. Father. Sorry, y'all. Let me. I'm so sorry, y'all. Okay. We have online stalking. Someone could be stalking him. Something about his father. I don't know if he's had issues with his father. We have new home, mansion. So did he recently purchase something new? We have cancer. Okay. So let's see. Y'all, the light is so bright. Let me... All right, sorry guys. <laughs> I'm like, why is the light so bright? So soulmate, he he does he does want true love. I definitely feel like he this is what he wants. He he does have a soulmate. I don't know if he's dealing with someone right now. I feel like they the the thing about him is I do feel like they have and them as a collective because they mirror each other so much. Like they've had issues when it comes to love. Like either they've kept their relationships private or they feel like they've had to keep things hidden here. Um, there's definitely an energy here of like someone holding on or so we have long blonde hair. So this this could be a female here. This female definitely changes her hair a lot. This I do see that there's a woman female around him. That he may be connected to. This female could change her hair a lot. This female is very pretty. Okay. We have Las Vegas. So something about. I don't know if they've ever been to Vegas. Or they may. I don't know. If they've ever went to Vegas. Something about Vegas. They may go to Vegas. Okay. So let's see. Ooh. We got marriage. With great fortune. So like I said, I feel like it's the same energy of him. I feel like he wants to get married. He has an idea of getting. I don't feel he's married. Guys, let me know. But I feel like he kind of fantasizes about this fairy tale love here. And 
this is what he really desires. Yes, he has fortune. Yes, he has money coming in. But I do feel like he feels kind of dissatisfied in a sense when it comes to like his love, his relationships. You know what I mean? We have stalker, breakouts, Libra, blonde hair female, again, blue hair female, leap of faith reverse. Okay, so <clears throat> someone is stalking him. Someone has a breakout. Again, does he have like skin care issues? I do see like, again, like pimples, breakouts, Libra energy, blonde hair female. This female could be a Libra or have Libra in her chart, leap of faith in reverse. There's something that he is afraid to take a risk. Maybe it's love because he doesn't want to get hurt again. We have blue hair. So he dyes his hair a lot. He has blue hair. Okay, we have issues with the law. Online dating. Secrets exposed. Model. So does he have issues with the law here? Does he have something coming up? Something legal? We have online dating. Secrets exposed model. There could be someone that may want to expose something here or have a or they they claim that they have a secret. It could be like a blog or something, allegedly. There's someone that is very attractive here that he finds very attractive. It feels like a feminine energy that he finds very beautiful. Okay. That he does find really, 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 really attractive here. But let's see. All right, he's came out. Unexpected income. Official person. Courthouse. House. Courtship in the reverse. With thoughts. What's the overall energy? Is thief. So. courtship reverse again it's that not having that connection that connection that he wants to have with someone i feel like again they have a lot of bad luck when it comes to love here um house in the reverse unexpected income official person courthouse did he recently get a house or buy a home? An un unexpected income makes me feel like paying someone back here, official person, courthouse. This could be like someone possibly. If it's not a house, it could definitely be like an apartment, a condo with official person, courthouse. This gives me the energy that it's like a government official or some this could be like a landlord or someone of authority over him this could be someone sending him papers maybe there was a contract here uh, maybe this was maybe could be like a loan or someone gave someone money and with the house in the reverse this is like someone wanting to take something back or foreclosing something here so I don't know if he's had issues with like a how living situation or if this is not a home. This is like a just a something stable foundation thief. This is like someone not like taking something. Interesting. What's not being seen? Great fortune. So something about money. Does he owe someone money? owe someone a lot of money here or this could be someone that stole some money or didn't pay something i'm just gonna leave it at that allegedly let me guys know down below so let me get the tea leaf cards <laughs> as i turn the deck problems to be resolved there's something that in the ink it looks like either a contract or something that he needs to he needs to like face or something or there's something that is like something could be coming back around or something that he needs to kind of deal with here. Let me see. Great 
great happiness in the reverse again we have yeah so i definitely feel like he feels <sighs> he feels kind of dissatisfied here okay we have ink pot so something about a contract okay broom bruh i can't make this up did he get a new home did he get a new home a new house or maybe he's looking for something new here trouble accusations so did someone accuse him of something or someone will accuse him you didn't do this maybe you didn't follow up with something here allegedly time to act in the reverse good luck heart love affection and caring in the reverse so i definitely feel like again this love energy keeps coming in for him maybe he feels like broken hearted or he feels like he wants to give up on love here Okay, maybe because he feels like he's been in cycles, indecisiveness. Maybe he feels like he's he hasn't gone far when it comes to love. August may be a significance to him, okay? Sorrow over a loss. So maybe he lost something in August or he's grieving over something. Or, you know, this could be a Leo energy, Virgo energy too here. Or this could something that could be happening here. We have tent, but it'll be temporary. Whatever he's going through or will go through, it'll be temporary. But someone's going to gossip about his secrets. Bro, I can't make that shit up. Someone is going to maybe gossip about him or someone has something of him or putting something over him. Like, oh, yeah, I'm going to tell you that, you know, I'm going to expose you. But we have rainbow, but it's going to it's not going to get too far here. Like, I feel like it's going to be OK. But great personal sorrow does he has a lot of depression i do feel like he does cry a lot or he's gonna be sad or he he is a, he has a sadness to him but he's such a sweet guy but he's very stubborn i feel like he's kind of set in his ways as well with certain things and he has a lot of pride i'm hearing um involvement with the law does a uh, bruh is he in trouble with the law or something let me know he pulled two more opportunity or windfall january so something about january maybe he got some money in january or next year may be a good month for him someone could also be very cold maybe someone could, he could be dealing with someone who's very cold or detached as well this female looks like a feminine energy but something about january may be a significance here let me pull one more Dark man. Dealings a relationship with a man with darker hair or complexion. Horse. Short journey. He's also going to be doing a lot, of, a lot of traveling as well here, okay? So let me pull these cards. Sorry this reading was so long, y'all. Give me... Give me a reading for messages for his love life can we start over so someone that he wants to come back towards it's someone coming towards him i feel like maybe this person i feel like he he's kind of going through an energy where he feels like he has to protect his heart possibly too when it comes to situations, it's like, who can I really, really trust? I miss you. Someone could be missing him. I can see myself with you long term in the reverse. Friends or family disapprove of this connection. <clears throat> Jealous and possessive. Let me pull two more. Reminiscing. Someone's thinking about someone. You are the person of my dreams. Okay. Okay. So I feel like there's someone or someone that could be hooked on him. He could be hooked on someone, but it's like this person could be very obsessive over someone here or over, have obsessive tendencies. But it's like the other person, it's almost like, why am I getting an energy? It's like, you know that someone's not good for you or this is not something long term, but it's like someone's settling or someone because they feel attached to someone or there's like an attachment here. Okay. 
let me pull the angel answers for him. What messages does his angels have to say to him? Okay, they're saying it's up to you. When it comes to a decision, it's the ball's in your court. You need to listen more to your intuition on what really what you want for yourself. So whatever that may mean for you, okay? Within the next few weeks. So something's going to come in within the next few weeks. And by then, you'll be ready to take action here, okay? Because then there's, yeah, there's going to be an opportunity coming in for you that's going to, that you're going to be ready for. I feel like there's going to be an opportunity presented to you, but it's up to you whether you're going to take this opportunity. But I feel like if you do take it, it's going to bring in a lot of success for you, okay? So that's what I got. Um, I hope you guys like this video, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.